when you get a chance, hon, can you hand me that latte? It's right back there. Mm-hmm. Oh, what Red is that? Revlon Super Illustrious Lip Gloss. Ooh. Do I look like Halle Berry? It's a good image. <laughs> when you are done sniffing it, I'd really like to drink that. Fine. <laughs> Hope you enjoy it. Ooh, someone missed our caffeine fix today. Sylvie, you can finish mine. Can't do it. Why not? Oh, oh my God, you did it! She gave up coffee, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, you've been threatening to do it, and now you did it. Did you have bad coffee breath? What? Oh, because my friend had the worst coffee breath. She gave up coffee, and now she's a spokesperson for vitamins. Who said anything about coffee breath? I gave up coffee because it makes me irritable. Lord, she's going through caffeine withdrawal. Oh, how am I going to face those kids without any caffeine? And, and at 2 o'clock, we have what we call a staff meeting, where the teachers and myself, we lock ourselves in my office, we put on a big pot of joe, and we say mean things about the kids. I need that time. You know who you remind me of? That woman, Jean Harris. She was a headmistress, too. She shot her boyfriend. He told her to go on a diet. Oh, should never tell a woman to do that. That is just plain rude. Mm. You know, after I give up caffeine, I'm going to give up red meat, and I'm going to give up sugar, and I'm going to give up salt, and I'm going to give up chocolate. Why is it that we always have to give up everything we love? I gave up white bread. It was the worst day of my life. I love that squishy white bread. It was like eating clouds. That must be what heaven feels like. Yeah. If I can't have caffeine, there's no reason for me to get up in the morning. You might as well kill me. Kill me. Somebody should kill me. You know, well, who knows what's good for you, what's bad for you? Yeah, like after that tofu scandal, what's bad for you, it's good for you. Yeah, you know, it's just a conspiracy to confuse us. Give me that cup. It's empty.